Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to make some rockets for New Year's Eve and we are starting with some toothpicks and they are a bit too big for this project so I am sanding them smaller. Then I'm just cutting off the tip in both ends of these toothpicks so that I have equal long pieces here for all my rockets. I'm kind of rolling the toothpick while I'm cutting, this way I don't get a ugly edge and I don't need to sand it. So I'm just rolling it carefully along the table with the uh, X-Acto knife, cutting off the piece that I want to cut off. I am going to use my extruder, my clay extruder, and I'm using a quite big hole for this. Just popping the orange clay that I conditioned into the extruder, if that's a hard word, <laughs> into the extruder and then I'm just extruding a long strip of the clay and I need this long strip to be nice and smooth uh, so I am actually using a bit of a clay softener, I'm not showing that but I actually put a tiny bit of a clay softener over the snake and then I'm just rolling it between two of my glass plates this way it's uh, being really nice and smooth on the surface like I want it to be. I'm extruding a tiny bit more of the clay because uh, I want to make the pointy hat for the rockets. So I'm just taking a tiny strip. I don't need that much for this one. And I am going to cut off a piece of this little snake here like that. And I'm trying to keep it round at the end point and I'm just pushing my finger down to make this point on the other end. And this way I get the tip for my rockets. So I'm just cutting off the little piece and squeezing it down while rolling it. This way I'm creating this uh, little pointy thing. Uh, it's not that difficult. Now I bake both of my things. After it has cooled down, I am cutting off around a centimeter of the arcane uh, thing that we made. And I'm gonna use that for the rocket, it's around a centimeter. And I'm just uh, making enough of these so that I have for the tips that I made. Now I'm going to put together these three parts. So I'm using my super glue gel and just putting a tiny bit of this uh, glue on top of one of these pins and placing the little pointy tip on top of it. Then I am going to take the little uh, toothpick and I'm gluing it onto the side of the cylinder of this little rocket here. Here I have my rockets ready for the next step. I made a print file for you guys and you need the lower part of the print file it is this one, the top one we will use another day, but for now we have this one ready. And I'm going to cut out these small um, rectangular pieces here, because we need those to decorate the rockets. So cut out as many of these that you need for your rockets. Then I am taking some black uh, sewing thread that's the word for it, and some paper uh, glue, or this is actually wood glue, but it's kind of the same stuff. I'm taking a bit of it on my finger and I'm just going to uh, pull the sewing thread through the glue a few times. Uh, I don't want to have too much glue on there, but I also want to have enough. And then I'm just gonna place it really straight on this uh, glass plate and let it dry. 
Now to the last part of this, I am going to use a tiny bit more of my wood glue. You can use a regular paper glue instead if you want that. I am going to take this uh, sewing thread and I'm cutting them up into pieces that is around a centimeter in length. And I am making one for each of my rockets. Then I'm taking one of these pieces of paper and I'm curling it over the back here of my knife, uh, no, my scissor, uh, so that it has a curly shape in the first place. Then I'm placing a tiny bit of glue here on the place where I want the piece of sewing thread. This is the piece where you light it up. Uh, I don't know the English name of that. Then I'm just going to place uh, enough glue on the paper so that it will stick all the way around. Do it in both sides here. And I'm just taking a quick look at the paper to see which way around I want it to go. And then I'm just going to place it around the sewing thread, the orange piece and the uh, uh, toothpicks. It's a toothpick. Let me show you that one more time in a little more close up. Just putting the glue on this piece of paper, looking on how I want it around there and just placing it here so it fits with the bottom part of the rocket, making sure it's really into the crevices around the little toothpick and just turn it around the little rocket making sure it's sitting really nice and good. And there you go, you have your rocket. That's all for today. Thank you for watching and happy crafting.